So today is Vlogmas Day 7 and today I thought might as well actually wrap gifts with you because I do have some more and I know on the very first day I showed you guys gifts that I already have set up but I just need to put tissue paper and all of that so I'm not quite done yet so I think today we're going to spend the time together wrapping gifts. But first I want to show you guys what we got here like what the situation is. Okay I got my handy dandy milk tea. Actually this is winter melon milk tea. I highly recommend. It tastes very good. I just, it's like if you want to spice up your milk tea game, get a winter melon milk tea. I want to share something with, with you guys really quick that just came into the mail like a few days ago and I, I'm just really excited to show you. I can't necessarily try it yet because we gotta wait till Christmas, okay? They are Christmas gifts, but I did treat myself a bit because, well, I'm just gonna show you. So in this bag, which by the way, thank you to my brother for getting this for my birthday. If you know, you know. So, I've decided, you know, I've seen this brand everywhere, okay? Um, I am a fan of hers. I watch her videos, and I have been for a while. On Black Friday, she did have a sale, and Cyber Monday, and I was like, okay, let me try it out. Let's buy one for my dad, because he's a big coffee drinker and my mom loves hot cocoa. And I thought might as well surprise them and give them something for Christmas. So dad, mom, if you're watching, um, look away now. I'll give you some time. Okay, I think you're not watching anymore. Anyways, I got this. Chamberlain coffee. If you know, you know. And I also got this. And the thing with, with her but the reason why I even bought it was because if you spend a certain amount, you get a free gift and stickers. And I'm like, what? who wouldn't want that? So here's the free gift. We got a mason jar. And stickers. Fantastic. So I just wanted to like unbox this really quick, I guess, to see what the jar looks like. <laughs> I know, it's such a simple... Like I can literally just open it, but I wanted to open it with you guys. Um, so let's check it out because I want to understand like the hype of it all. I can't drink these yet because like I said, I have to wait till Christmas, but let's just see. Here's the jar, can you see it? I should probably. <laughs> Got like a screen print of Chamberlain coffee and then says, uh, roasted in California, but it was free, so I can't get mad, right? You can't get mad at that. And I'm excited for my dad to try it and my mom. It just looks so nice though, don't you think? Like the packaging, they really knew how to design it. So I got the White Fox Hazelnut Blend Medium Roast Toasted Hazelnut Apple Pie. Interesting, but I'm just excited for this mainly, you know? Who wouldn't like stickers? We have a cat, okay, a cat, a bird, a dog, and an owl. If you've had Chamberlain coffee before, um, comment down below which one, which blend do you like? So that I can like keep tabs and give it to my dad because he's like, oh, and my, and my brother too. They, they're like the two coffee drinkers at the moment. Um, I can smell a bit of it. It's like coming through and it smells very nice, let me tell you. So yeah. We just gotta wait till Christmas to open this up, and don't worry, I will vlog that, so be on the lookout. So yeah, I'm just gonna wrap that, and we'll just get into it.
Okay, while I'm rapping, um, did any of you hear the new Sidemen Christmas song? Actually, they, they released two. Um, I don't even know if any of you watched Sidemen, but I'm just gonna talk about them because I honestly liked their songs. Um, of course, in terms of the first group, the expensive group, I think their song is an absolute banger. <laughs> I think the, the expensive song, it can go far. You know, you have JME, who's a rapper, um, and then you have JJ, who's also like a famous rapper at this point. So of course the song is gonna do well. And then the music video was like so well produced. I don't even, I don't even know how Khan was able to pull that off, but he did. And they did that all in one day. So yeah, honestly, check out the video if you guys haven't watched it, it's so funny. And then the cheap team, like with Harry and them, um, hilarious, let me tell you. Um, the song itself, I kid you not, I was dying of laughter because of that first drop and you'll know why when you watch it or if you've seen it you'll you know what I'm talking about that's why they're like my favorite YouTube group out there because the humor or at least British humor is such a it's so I don't know how to explain British humor it's just like a next level So I finished wrapping the gifts now. I just need to put it under the tree. And for the most part, these are for my family or like my parents and my brother. The rest of the gifts, uh, like for my friends and other family, I just need to put gift tissue in them. So we'll just do that another time. But for the most part, I'm done. And yeah. Hello and welcome to day 18 of Vlogmas. Yes, you heard that right. Uh, day 18. <laughs> I have skipped many, many days and I do apologize because I had finals week last week, which basically means that at the end of the semester, so around December time, you have an entire week where you take tests, do projects, papers, all of that, turn it in for a final grade. So I've just been busy studying and doing homework and projects and all of that collaborations and you know it's been hectic but now we're done so now i finally have time to relax and focus on this vlogmas i'm gonna do my best from now until christmas which honestly is less than 10 days i think seven days because it's december 18th as i'm recording this crazy time goes by so fast and we're already at christmas so yeah i do apologize though i know some of you are waiting for you know the next installment of vlogmas but uh, i just did not have time so again sorry but i'm here so let's get into it if you guys haven't noticed something different i mean it's not a drastic change or anything but i got a haircut uh me and my mom went to get our haircuts this morning which i will insert some clips right now So yeah, um, I got my hair cut. I haven't had <laughs> my hair cut in like in over a year and a half. It's been very long since I had a haircut. But the thing is like I barely get haircuts. I don't really want to get haircuts. I don't really feel like getting one. I don't know. I'm not a big person of change when it comes to my appearance. I kind of keep things simple and I'm okay with having something to be the same for like a long time. Um, and it doesn't bother me. So I don't know. I think because my mom wanted to get a haircut, I decided might as well get one because I haven't had one in the whole year yet. And it's Christmas time soon. So might as well, you know, get new hair for the new year. But yeah, uh, so this is the salon that I go to. Uh, I have been going to her since 
many, many years. Maybe since I was like, maybe like 15. No, I'm kidding. I've been to that salon since I was like 12. Um, and she's been my person ever since. Her, so my hairstylist is Sophia. And she's basically been watching me grow since I was like 12. Which is crazy because like she's looked the same all this time. <laughs> So it's been a few hours now, but we're gonna go out and eat some Korean barbecue for my brother's birthday. It's like a late celebration, but we're basically gonna go to his favorite Korean place and I'm gonna take you guys with me. Okay, we're going to Korean barbecue right there. I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> okay, we're gonna eat right there. Right there, boom. Here is where we ate in that Korean barbecue place. Let me show you the. So you have these in there. But yeah, the food was really good. Very expensive though, but very good nonetheless. How do you guys like the food? Oh my God, it's very good. Hi. Oh. Tasty and great. Tasty and great. <laughs> I know we just went to Korean barbecue, but we're gonna get boba now. Boba from here. Boba time. Oh. Oh, there's a lot of right here. Okay. Oreo milk tea. So for today's music talk, I want to change it up a bit. I want to give you guys something that's international, something that's not English, because I love songs that aren't English, honestly. Um, I find a lot of cool songs that aren't English, and I really stand by finding music outside of your native language, um, outside of your comfort zone, and I find that comfort um, in Brazilian music, I think Portuguese, especially Brazilian Portuguese, is, is such a beautiful language. Uh, so for today's song, I want to share with you guys uh, Não Identificado 
I think that's how you say it. Uh, because honestly, if you guys ever heard Brazilian Portuguese, it's the way they pronounce words are so different. Um, you know, I went to school for Spanish. Um, I know a little bit. I don't remember a lot of it, but definitely different from Portuguese. Of course, it's all within the family, but in terms of just how Brazilian Portuguese sounds, it's so, oh, and then especially in music too, like, it's so nice. Um, if you've ever listened to like Bossa Nova and all of that, you were like, first of all, the instrumentals, uh, they're geniuses. It, it sounds so good. But yeah, now Identificado by Gal Costa. Correct me if I'm wrong, if I mispronounced that completely. So I watched the movie Bakurao on Showtime recently. I didn't finish it. Uh, me and my mom started it a little bit, but like the very beginning of the movie, that song, the Now Identificado, popped up and I just immediately fell in love with it. Um, it's just super relaxing and the language is beautiful and it's just right down my alley. So yeah, I want to share with you guys that and I have already added it to the playlist. So once again, check the playlist if you haven't already, follow along. I'm basically... Uh, sharing one song each video I upload uh, just because I, I love music and I hope you do too. So yeah, that's Music Talk.